Time travel has not yet been invented. But 30 years from now, it will have been. Looper is a time travel action movie. And basically, a Looper is a specialized assassin who lives in the movie's present day, but works for a mob in the future. And so when mobs in the future need someone to disappear, they zap them back in time to our Looper, and the Looper shoots him and gets rid of the body. Joseph Gordon-Levitt plays a killer, and his job gets greatly complicated when his future self is sent back, and he has orders to kill him. And the movie is kind of a cat and mouse game of what happens. Einstein had this great insight that really, we shouldn't think of space as this three-dimensional place, but we should think of time as just the fourth dimension in this four-dimensional entity called space-time. The bottom line from Albert Einstein's special relativity, yes, time travel is possible. If my students and I succeeded in building a time machine right here in my lab, now in 2012, then there is really nothing stopping the 2020 version of Max Tegmark from getting in there and coming back here and meeting me. There are certainly scenarios in physics that would allow you to indeed affect your future by going back in time and doing something. And this is not completely ruled out. It's, it's hard to figure out how it, that might happen, but it could. I think people are fascinated by the prospect of going back because it's just so tempting to imagine you could go back. Sun is turning into your eyes. And your face looks backwards. Yeah. So do you know what's gonna happen? You done all this already? As me? I don't want to talk about time travel. Because if we start talking about it, then we're gonna be here all day talking about it, making diagrams with straws. It doesn't matter. When I hurt myself. It changes your body. This is what I do now. Change your memory. It doesn't matter. The trouble with going backward in time is that if you interfere with the past in a way that would affect the present. I can't let you walk away from this diner alive. This is my life now. I earned it. You had yours already. So why don't you do what old men do and die? Just take your little gun out between your legs and do it. Boy. If you really could do it, I can't imagine you wouldn't be tempted to the point of giving in to do something to just fix it because you know how to fix it now. You have the benefit of hindsight. I think it would be irresistible. I'm sorry.